This is Gary Atensi with CNTV, and today we're in Parker, Colorado. I am here at Parker Integrated Health. Since 2004, they've been providing a wellness and chronic care clinic for patients here in Parker, as well as South Denver. Thanks so much for joining us, Doctor. Let's, let's start off about a little history of the two of you, how you got started here, and what got you involved in this, uh, this line of work. Um, well, my husband and I met in chiropractic school in Dallas, and um, we decided Douglas County was just the place that we wanted to be. It's really family-oriented. Since we started 11 years ago, our practice has really evolved into much more than just um, chiropractic, and it's more of a whole body looking at you know blood work, brain function, and a, v a variety of different things besides just chiropractic. Wonderful. Speaking of evolving, quite honestly, as we move into the 21st century, medicine, health is constantly evolving. I mean, um, well, we were all familiar with traditional medicine. I, I grew up with that. What are we talking about when we speak of functional medicine now? So um, there is obviously a great need for traditional medicine. I mean, if I get into a car accident please, and my spleen is hanging out, please take me to a medical doctor. Right. However, if I have... Um, chronic illnesses and things that, you know, Western medicine has a difficulty handling. Um, that's where functional medicine comes into play. We look at blood work differently than uh, most medical doctors do. We look at it more based on healthy ranges when we look at lab reports. We don't want to just know, is the person sick? We want to know, are they healthy? And if they're not healthy, how can we get them there? Uh, this is a proactive approach because, quite honestly, you want the body to be running optimal. You want to keep it that way rather than waiting for it to break down. You take care of it on the front end. Um, this is kind of a, a new approach for a lot of folks out there because we don't even go check out the doctor until we're kind of hurting. Right. Absolutely. And a lot of our patients, you know, they come in with their own blood work and they say, well, here it is, but my medical doctor says... There's nothing wrong with me. Well, that person is really feeling something. There is something going on. So we delve a little bit deeper and try to make connect the dots, basically, of what that blood work really shows. Um, so by that, you know, our ranges are much more narrow. Instead of being broad based on sick people, they're much more narrow. And so that's how kind of we direct how we're going to go. One thing that um, patients understand is pain. And obviously, we, we get that signal from from our body through our brain. Share with me what functional neurology is and how the brain really plays a big part. Sure. Um, it's, it's pretty amazing, actually. The, um, the brain, as we know, controls absolutely everything. And what we do in our practice through some functional neurology is we do a neurological exam to determine what side of the brain and what parts of the brain are not functioning as well as the other ones. Through that, through our different exams, we can figure out what kind of techniques, what kind of um, movements would really help this person stimulate that weaker side brain. A lot of people don't realize, I mean, we've all had some kind of brain injury. I mean, just growing up, when you start learning how to walk, you fall, you hit your head. Some people don't respond or don't react very horribly to it but some over time it adds up and we're all unique so we're able to find those tiny little intricacies that make your problem may maybe it won't show up on a ct scan or an mri but it's a soft lesion something else that we can detect and that we might be able to help you with you're talking about really almost retraining the brain um, to be back in a healthy range again. Um, this obviously takes some time for it to get back there. Is that correct? Absolutely. And one of the techniques that we do use is uh, neurofeedback, um, which that's really exercising and training the brain. And we've been um, doing that for seven or eight years, but it's been around for over 40 years, which is pretty amazing. Um, and it literally is exercise for the brain, which many of us, we think we use our brain, you know, and, and we do, <laughs> most of us do, but there are many parts of our brain that we don't use, and it's just like they say, you don't use it, you lose it. I mean, it's, it's amazing. We all, we all know and we believe to go to the gym, work out our muscles, work out everything, but we don't even think about that when it comes to the brain. One of the amazing things I'm surprised with is once you actually get to the retraining of the brain, get it back to a healthy range, this is long-term. I mean, it actually holds pretty well, does it not? Absolutely. It is permanent change. Um, you know, if you unfortunately hit your head again or some sure. emotional trauma hits you, you might need a little tweak here and there, but it is permanent brain changing, basically, um, which is 
really great. <laughs> that, that is very neat. I mean, obviously, wellness is something that um, a lot of folks are really turn into for the fact that um, in traditional, a lot of times we're adding to the body. We have high blood pressure, low blood pressure, take a pill, do this. In, in wellness, it's really taken away from the body certain things that are ailing. Is that correct? Absolutely. Um, you know, going back to the history of chiropractic and removing subluxations um, in which, you know, subluxations can be caused from you know, all kinds of different toxins, emotional trauma, stress, that sort of stuff. And so, yeah, we look to figure out um, what truly is causing the problem, not just, okay, so your blood pressure is high. We don't want to just throw something at you. We don't even just want to throw a supplement at you. We want to figure out why is it high, what's causing it, and how can we get that down in the most natural way possible. Adjustments are still a piece of the pie, obviously, here, um, because obviously the lifeline is our spine. We're talking about all these signals coming up through it. Um, just so the folks know, what are some of the problems that can happen on that lifeline that um, can be taken care of if caught early enough? Um, sure. You know, just about anything. I mean, a lot of people complain about constipation, okay? And, and that could be traced back to the nervous system. You know, you have your parasympathetic system and your um, sympathetic system. In the United States and in many other developed countries, we're undergoing stress every second, constantly. And so our body is always into the sympathetic overload, where it's the fight or flight type thing. Um, if you don't get that rest and digest from your parasympathetics, well, then you start suffering constipation because that's rest and digest. That's when the body's supposed to do that. Along with that is insomnia. That's a big one. If you're not sleeping, your body can't heal. And so um, what's interesting is a lot of people come into a chiropractor for lower back issues. Those same nerves that go to your low back that are causing pain go to different organs in your body that produce function. So that's why you'll see constipation issues. That's why you'll see um, people who have little kids that wet, still wet the bed, you know, and that sort of stuff. So... Yeah, it's pretty amazing what can be done even just with chiropractic. That's wonderful. Obviously, we get in an auto accident and we've been hurt. Uh, we get a broken arm, we go to the doctor. But a lot of the times we get in a, a major accident and there's something happened, we don't even realize it. Maybe that of whiplash or basically um, you've got a slipped disc or a pinched nerve. These are all things that over time you start realizing something's wrong. Are these things that you treat as well? Absolutely. And a lot of people don't make that connection with, you know, the car accident that they had five, ten years ago. It's just everybody's got that um, tilting point where if your body can only take so much and then it's going to say, hey, I have had enough. You need to help me out here. So absolutely. I mean, the whiplash is a big thing and it's not just from car accidents. Roller coasters will give you whiplash. Um, falling and, you know, falling down on the floor will, will give you whiplash. And the problem with that is not just, you know, the, the mechanics of the spine. It's, it's the possibility of having a little bit of brain trauma because your brain in a whiplash injury swaps yeah. forward, you know, hits the skull and then hits back and hits the back of the skull. And so you can have two injuries there. So absolutely, we, we do it from the inside out, from the top to the bottom. Like you say, I mean, folks out there, they understand maybe to seek out a chiropractor with lower back pain or sciatic pain, but there's so many things that uh, don't even seem related like that, maybe headaches or bedwetting or things that really um, I, I wouldn't think of coming to this type of wellness for. Is that what you find for folks that come in here? Are they, are they pleasantly surprised that some of these things can be taken care of? Absolutely. And, you know, we never claim to cure anything. What's amazing is when you can get the body working right, things take care of themselves like they're supposed to take care of themselves. You have that spinal cord and all those spinal nerves. And if the brain can communicate with the rest of the body properly, then the brain knows when something's wrong, going wrong down here. And it says, oh, hey, I need to fix that. But as I mentioned earlier, if your body has been it hit its tilting point, the brain has a difficult time even figuring that out. And so that's when you, you need our help. One of the things we hear a lot about is stress management. Everyone's trying to eat better, exercise. But if you actually have the body working optimally, um, what does that do for, the, for stress, the, the kind that we feel all the time? Uh, if you have the body working optimally, then, I mean, your body can handle stress much better. You're able to sleep better. You're, you're able to do that rest and digest, which our bodies crave. Um, so... Chiropractic is a solution for a lot of those different things that people don't really know where to go to for help with it. 
That is great. Viewers, take a look at the bottom of the screen right there. What you're going to see is the website. First of all, on the website, you're going to learn of some of the conditions they're able to treat. We've got some of them scrolling on the screen right now. I mean, it's it's quite more of a list than people would realize that can be taken care of. Quite honestly, um, they're not looking to cure something down here. They're basically making sure that your body is in optimal health. So really, it takes care of itself. And um, keep in mind there, we're talking about two doctors that basically met together in chiropractic school, um, realized the need here in Douglas County, and basically have made this their hometown. Let me ask you this. Um, when it comes to a consultation, you provide free consultations, then go on the website there, click on what takes place at a consultation for folks? Uh, well, we just listen first to see exactly what the person has um, going on. It's not a little five minute, hey, what's going on? We want to hear your history. And in fact, we like to get um, previous blood work, um, take a look at that. And so the consultation, we just discuss what the person has going on, how long it's been going on, um, those sorts of things. We'll do a neurological exam. And depending on what we're trying to work on, we might do a, a brain map, a QEG, um, or we, we may have to do x-rays if we feel that's necessary. So um, it, it's all really patient independent. So it all depends on what they have going on. Like you said, in the past 11 years, you've evolved. Obviously, the, the, the adjustments are still something that takes place here, but also new technology, cold laser. I see a lot of different equipment around me that really you're able to um, pull a lot out of, uh, out of the hat, if you will, as far as uh, tools that can help folks. Would you like to share any of those with me? Sure. Um, we, do, we do have cold laser. We've been doing that, and it's really great. Cold laser actually heals at a mitochondrial level, so your cells are healing, which is pretty great. It's cold, so it doesn't even feel like anything, um, but it actually it really does work. Uh, we do oxygen therapy. The brain really needs oxygen to function optimally. We do vibration therapy. We do a lot of brain-based therapies to stimulate the brain. Um, we do a lot. We do acupuncture also, and it just it just really fits perfectly with chiropractic also. Uh, and then, as I mentioned earlier, the neural feedback is just extraordinary. Wonderful. Speaking, like you said, of the cold laser, you really don't feel anything. This is a non-invasive approach, so we're talking about all age groups. What are some of the ages you can you can um, actually take care of here? Oh, we see, you know, newborns, um, and we nice. treat them through uh, really super light adjustments. I mean, we're honored that parents um, trust us enough to work on their newborn babies, and we see people all the way up into their 90s, um, you know, those really health-conscious individuals that know how important it is to make maintain a healthy lifestyle. That's always amazed me that we all know the mothers go through a lot of trauma in that period of delivery, but even a baby that's brand new, you think they're perfect, they've also gone through trauma as well, and you never, never too early to start. Absolutely. I mean, if you think about, you know, a baby being in the womb, it's nice, warm, cozy, dark, and most babies are born in a hospital, and it's bright lights, strange people, strange voices, and it's it's kind of traumatic. Yeah, exactly. So there's that. And then depending on the birth process itself, um, people think, oh, C-section, so easy. But there are issues with C-sections also. Um, baby doesn't get the proper bacteria if it doesn't go through the, the canal. Um, and, you know, forceps could, could be traumatic for the baby also. There's uh, the entire birth process can be quite tra traumatic for both the mom and the baby. I can see your passion coming through because you're fascinated by what you do. I mean, you're fascinated by what you've learned. Really, that, uh, that's what it boils down to is educating your patients on how their body works, maybe getting rid of some of the myths that they believe. Is that what is important to you every day? Absolutely. Um, like you said, we're constantly learning new things to figure out how else can we help our patients, you know. Um, and if something doesn't work, we're going to find something else that will work. So it is super important for us. Diet is huge. I mean, we talk to people about their nutrition all the time. You know, what goes in is going to come out. And so that's really important to us also. But just constantly staying cutting edge, finding out exactly um, how we can help them. How we can help you. Thanks so much, Dr. Viewers. Last time, take a look at the bottom of the screen right there. You're going to see their contact information. It's just as easy as basically filling out a piece there on the website. You can set up a free consultation. If it's a chiropractor or something you've never experienced before, come on in. We're talking about a non-invasive approach to getting you well. It's a wellness center. Maybe you're, in, maybe you're in pain and people haven't been able to find what it is. We're talking about very advanced technology uh, or neuropathy. And this is, this is the place 
place that you can really learn more about your body as well. It's time to take back your, wait a minute, <laughs> it's time to take back your life. This is Gary Atensu with CNTV, and if you don't know, now you know.